this is Open Minded Trader Channel. I'm going to break down the trades that I took this morning from XAU USD around London session and this morning also around New York session, okay? So this is very, very simple. I'm not going to make things very complicated. I just want to make sure that you guys get it and understand the easy concept here, okay? So when you go to the four hour time frame, you realize the market was making uh, high, high, high lows until it broke a structure to the downside, okay? Until it, it broke this structure to the downside, broke and then created a lot of liquidity to the upside and then left an empty supply zone right there okay there is always a liquidity before before uh, you head to supply zone or demand zone so we left an empty supply zone right there all right so now recently we have this short-term move that's heading towards the and uh, towards the supply zone okay right there making high 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 lows so when you go to the low time frame okay let's go to low time frame and see what's going on with this structure that's heading towards the supply zone okay one hour time frame okay one hour time frame what happened in the one hour time frame is we were still making high 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 lows we broke structure right there made higher highs and then i took my trade right there at a demand zone to target the higher time frame supply zone okay so very very easy and what time was this time it was three o'clock 3 a.m central time and it was a London session, okay? London session, all right? So I took the trade, targeted the supply zone, and this was a trade that gave me around uh, eight to six, uh, eight, eight to six ra ra ratio about, you know, uh, man, it was a lot of pips, basically. It was a lot of pips, about 197 pips, you know, and uh, points in the stop loss, and how much okay give me one second please so the overall was uh, I, I probably get about okay about uh, 170 pips in total okay so this was an amazing trade very very easy very simple and my advice to you is take the trades from check the overall trend which is you know uptrend or downtrend and then you only take your trades around supply zones on demand zones and you only find supply and demand zones around the high lows or the low highs very easy okay stay away from the liquidity zones stay away from the double tops the double bottoms whatever it is that they teach in the books does not exist anymore all right because that is where the big banks and the big institutions you know target because they know those are the obvious you know areas where they can you know target and stop out retail traders so if you want to see more videos like this please connect to my channel go ahead and subscribe make sure you like and share the video if you have any questions please put it in the comment section Thank you very much. Peace.